Well, of course, uh, Peter, that uh, historical moment uh, taking place now, as I speak to you, the mother of uh, the slain UDF activist, Don Pisipe, now making her way here to the home of uh, the late struggle icon, Mamu Inima Tixela Mandela, and of course, um, flanked by members of uh, the ANC, a party which she has said that uh, she still remained a member of. And of course, uh, uh, as I've said before, this marks a history because uh, this is the first time that uh, Mom Joyce Bay is coming to the house of the late struggle icon. And of course, you remember that uh, the story of uh, 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 Stompy Sipay's death has always cast a dark cloud on uh, the legacy of Mom Winnie Matixela Mandela. Uh, you recall Stompy was murdered in 1989. And of course, uh, many saying that uh, Mamu Mandela was implicated in that murder. But of course, uh, uh, the mother of uh, Stompy Sipay, my Joyce, uh, who's now walking in, flanked by the ANC Secretary General going to visit the house has always maintained that um, she believes that uh, Mama Winnie Matikizala Mandela is innocent and that she was really not involved. And of course, uh, in that interview on Sunday with the SABC and other media, also reiterating uh, those words, saying that she does not believe that uh, Mama Winnie Matikizala Mandela, of course, is involved in the murder. And of course, um, her visit here is seen as a symbol, really, and an important one that is hoped to finally put this matter to rest once and for all. And of course, um, we're hoping to speak to Mama Sepe uh, later on when she comes out of the family. But um, she has indicated that she'll also be attending the memorial service as well as the funeral of Umama. And of course, um, uh, seen here, of course, arriving at the house, as she had said that she will come and visit the family to come and also pay her tribute to the family. Now, Umama Sepe has arrived in Soweto to come and pay the tribute. Mangoba, a lot of uh, interest, uh, uh, particularly around this visit. And as you said in uh, the uh, uh, commentary that you were giving us there, that this had been a c central name and figure in the story uh, that threatened to, I suppose, uh, cast a shadow over Mama Winnie Madigazela's as, um, legacy. But it seems that with this visit, uh, a lot of that will be swept away. Well, certainly, Peter, that's what uh, it's hoped uh, this will do because uh, really this has been an issue that uh, has been hanging over the head of the struggle icon. It's an issue that certainly has been uh, a matter that uh, has not uh, been a good one in terms of the legacy that uh, she has left, uh, her fight for freedom in this country. And of course, um, the visit by Mayim Joyce is very important today as it does really show that um, she has really put this matter behind her and that uh, she's coming to... Uh, really pay her tribute to Mamu Inima Tixela Mandela and of course it shows in fact that um, she is uh, she has moved on from this issue and of course um, that uh, many other people who still had doubts over this issue should do the same so it is really a symbolic visit here to the family and one that's hoped really Peter will put this matter uh, to bed once and for all. All right, Mangoba, we'll leave it there for the time being, but uh, we'll get a little bit more on that. And uh, it was uh, earlier this week already that uh, the former police commissioner, George Fivers, who was appointed police chief in 1995, actually said that they reopened the case because a lot of the cases uh, during the apartheid era were not closed properly, and uh, they reopened it to investigate it, and they said they found no evidence uh, to link Winnie Mandela to uh, Stompy pays death and they said that uh, any uh, uh, accusations were baseless and so that was as far back as uh, when he was police commissioner in the early 1990s so I guess people will continue to wonder why if the police commissioner as far back as the 1990s had declared uh, Mama Winnie why this uh, uh, legacy or this uh, uh, accusation had uh, lingered for so long but it seems uh, that particularly with the visit of uh, Stompy's mother to uh, Mama Winnie's house uh, that it's probably now is going to be put to rest and those uh, people that were doubters might be re-looking at this but as I said uh, the police commissioner who opened the case reinvestigated it said that uh, as far back as the 1990s that there was no evidence uh, to link uh, Winnie Madigazela Mandela to Stompy Sip pays death. Well, much has been written about Mama Winnie's big heart and uh, indomitable uh, community spirit.